Hello, my name's Ikello Herod, and this is Ikello Photo. I'm a little late on my video this week, but it's going to be about Canva. There'll be a link in the description of this video, and we are going to have ourselves a good time using Canva to do a couple of things. So uh, I'm going to make a thumbnail, like the thumbnails that I make for my videos right in front of you. I'm going to use one of my pictures from my Get the Shot episode where I was doing a self-portrait of myself. And I'm going to very quickly create a YouTube thumbnail in Canva. All right, here we go. Ready? Here we are in Canva. And uh, it's a very basic web page. That web page at the top, at the top uh, left-hand corner of your uh, screen is Canva. It says Canva. And if you click on that, it always takes you to home. In the upper left-hand corner, you can click on that and create a design. All right, here we go. And all right, I'm clicked in. And here is right under the StreamYard logo uh, is you can click a design and scroll through all these different kinds of designs. Today, we're going to make a YouTube thumbnail. So here we are in Canva. And as you can see on the right-hand side of the, uh, actually the left-hand side right over here is a bunch of designs. And as I scroll through those designs right in here, it's never ending. I mean, seemingly never ending. But just to make it as quick as possible, we're going to take something that kind of uses a cut out picture. Uh, let's go back up. Where was that? That one right there. And instead of uh, this guy being there, I'm going to take him out, put him in the trash. I'm going to taking him out and I've already taken the liberty of uploading a picture of myself and I'm going to go to my uploads and here it is. I'm going to add it right there and as you can see it automatically scales and if I want to I can fix this picture so that I can get rid of the background. And because I lit this picture well, I'm able to actually, uh, it's able to algorithmically figure out how to remove the background. And so I just click on that remove button and it's going to churn for a couple seconds because it's got to go out to the cloud, do its thing, come back. And so let's give it a second. I'll be right back. And there you go. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Look at that. It did that good a job. Just cut it out. As long as you have a nice, clean picture of yourself, you can pretty much do this every single time. Me and my, my sister and I have a YouTube channel. It's called Herod Crypto Media. And uh, I'm going to actually be changing our uh, logos and stuff like that. How about this? We'll, we'll change the, this right there to our crypto media channel is about crypto. <laughs> and uh, we're thinking about starting up a mining rig and doing a whole bunch of stuff. So stay tuned for that over there. But we're going to change this to don't miss the and we will spread it out so that it still fits and then we'll go down to the one that's under it that box actually we'll move this out of the way get to the box and we will make the box just a wee bit longer so that we can fit don't miss the not quite still needs to be a little longer and then it should fit in just nicely. I mean, just barely, but just nicely. And as I click off of it, yep, don't miss the Bitcoin put right in here, train. Don't miss the Bitcoin train. And uh, you know what? 
we're going to take my picture and slide slide me on even more. We're going to make Bitcoin a little bit bigger and lock it. And as you can see, see this, uh, it, it will automatically center itself on the circles or the squares that you create behind it so that it gives itself, uh, makes it nice and easy for you to do things with it. And there you go. That is a thumbnail right there. Boom. Now, I don't necessarily like the red in the background. So we're going to maybe change that red to yellow. And no, and you can go up here and uh, undo that. You could even go with blue. But then it has that background that is, how was that background created? I think they used some kind of texture or element. But I'm just going to keep it with the red because it looks real good. And really simple, real quick, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial on Canva. It is a free app. It is a app that is online you can get it on if you have an iphone you can get the actual app on your iphone i think they have a app for the for android they also have a full-fledged app for the ipad that works just like the website you can upload things and it you can carry it around with you all over the world you can make easy things happen as long as you have a web connection anyway my name is ikello harrod and I hope that you like and you subscribe to Ikello Photo. And I'm sorry that I didn't get a, a video out on Friday. It's just uh, I've got a, another project that I've been working on, and it's kind of been eating into my schedule. Anyway, my name's Ikello Herod. I need you to love the camera that you're with. Talk to you soon.